very warm welcome to the Allianz Arena in Munich. So, here we go then. Portugal against Argentina. I'm John Champion and analysing this game for us is Jim Beglin. Hello John, hello everyone. It's a real pleasure to be here. The spectators rise for the national anthem. Portugal start with this 11. In goal, it's Rui Patricio. Nani, Hugo Almeida, Ronaldo providing the goal scoring threat. And now Argentina, Sergio Romero. In goal, Messi, Iquain tasked with scoring goals. Here's Nani. An important interception. Things were starting to look dangerous. Higuain. Played into space out wide. Lovetsi. Can he now find a finish? Fisted away by the keeper. Ronaldo, he goes alone. Cristiano Ronaldo, oh, that's neat. Enzo Perez, Messi, oh, fine through ball down the middle. Where's the defence? That could have been really special. And it just goes to show you how effective those through balls can be. All it needed was a better execution. Well, that should set them on their way and get into a nice rhythm. The early signs are very encouraging now. Hugo Almeida. Pumps it upfield. Both sides fiercely contesting the ball. The ball's with Higuain. Higuain. He's onside here. Higuain. It's a good hit! Well, once the keeper lost control of that, it could have gone either way, but it was a good reaction for the defender. Through into space it goes. Ronaldo! It's cleared away from danger. He's bursting forward. A chance! Nil-nil still, chances at a premium. Long ball forward. Off he goes. Nani seems 
eager to show that there's more to his game than scoring goals. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, your striker should be the first line of that defence and, and he's delivering. Levetsi. The danger was there, he dealt with it well. It's played through. Figlia. It's Enzo Perez. He hits it. It was a good ball in, but no goal. I think there's always that danger that the defence can get exploited in that way. That must have served as a real wake-up call to them. Maserano, Zabaleta, De Michelis, Diglia. They get it forward. Maserano, Zabaleta, Enzo Perez. It's Hugo Almeida. Here's Cristiano Ronaldo. The flag stays down. The cross repelled. Xiao Moutinho. Ah, caught offside that time. Hit long by the keeper. An entertaining game this. Both teams have had a number of chances. Alas, it's still nil-nil. Zabaleta. Viglia. Higuain. Jao Pereira. Jao Moutinho. It's Messi. Higuain shoots. Argentina that is simply unsavable Argentina, one goal in front. Oh, look, it's lovely having a player with such ability in your side. He's always capable of coming up with something important. And he's done it again. Enzo Perez. Biglia. De Michelis. Garay. Levetsi. Maserano. Enzo Perez. Portugal have got possession back. It's a dangerous moment, but he was there to intervene. Mascherano. Well intercepted. Saw the danger and got to it. Cristiano Ronaldo. Rani. It's opened up nicely for him. Raul Morales. He misses. Only narrowly, though. He's over the ball, his teammates waiting. Leaps for the header. And he's done it! A really well-worked set-piece, that. Oh, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met, it really was.
So we resume with the scores back left. And there's the end to the first 45. Look, this match promised goals and it certainly hasn't let us down. It's been really, really entertaining. One all as it stands, so nothing to separate them. So, second half underway. Here's Hibwain. Biglia. Zabaleta. Maserano. Biglia. It's Higuain. Enzo Perez. Lovetsi. Argentina with a big chance and a big miss. Jao Pereira. It's been launched forward. The opposition posing a few questions, but he's able to intercept. Lovetsi. Higuain. It's Higuain. Higuain shoots. Tried to play it through. It's played into space. He's not taking any risks there. Up for the header. Denied by the post. No, that's control in the end. Portugal had players queuing in the box in that situation and they've still got nothing to show for it. What a complete and utter waste. Fabio Cointrao picks the ball up straight from a goal kick. Cristiano Ronaldo. Mascherano. Bruno Alves. João Moutinho. Balls with Cristiano Ronaldo. Play surges forward. Mascherano. Biglia. Marcos Rojo. Portugal still not utilising their bench. Biglia. Marcos Rojo. Biglia. Garay. It's Higuain. Lovetsi. I think they're building the play really nicely. If they can just find the right through ball, they could be in on goal. Aimed at the wing, and it's come through to him. Lovetsi. Raul Morales. Here's Cristiano Ronaldo. He makes his way towards the penalty area. Enzo Perez. Messi. Staring straight at his opposite number. Marcos Rojo. The space on the flank. Higuain. Lovetsi. Messi. That was certainly struck well enough. Argentina with a big chance and a big miss. Vital touch by the keeper. There's a platform for a counter attack. Oh, good challenge, and he's got it back. If the score remains as it is, we'll be heading to extra time. In 
Alejandro Perez. He's on his way. Can he find a finish? Messi. An opportunity missed. Well, maybe the tension around this game played a part in that because he should have put them ahead then. It's Higuain. Showing some good skills, but ultimately unsuccessful. João Pereira. Higuain shoots. Only a matter of millimetres in that. Well, I think the keeper knows all too well that there was no getting anywhere near that. That's a big escape. We all know what he can do. Well, he's certainly a player I'd be more than happy to watch. Tactically, he's almost impossible to stop. Cristiano Ronaldo. And he chooses the option of the back pass. Garay. Di Maria. Garay. Maserano. Viglia. De Michelis. There'll be two additional minutes. Well, maybe they're settling for what they have because they're not going to score from there. It's Enzo Perez. There is the full time whistle. And still the teams are deadlocked. Yeah, both sides did start playing for a draw towards the end, but it was all very disappointing. For me, not much of a spectacle for these supporters. There's the full-time whistle, and with the score still level, we're heading for extra time. Spooned forward. Zabaleta. Higuain Maserano Just needed a better ball there Everything else about the move looked good I thought it was good vision But the execution was poor Miguel Veloso Hugo Almeida Tried to play it through yeah, it looked like there that he was asking just a little too much of himself to try and thread that ball through. He's was, uh, was a bit over-ambitious, but I like his thinking. Augusto Fernandez. Aguero. Augusto Fernandez, Maxi Rodriguez. It's Campagnaro. The ball is with Messi. Iguain. Augusto Fernandez. The ball's with Aguero. The keeper was tested there. He knows very well he can score from that distance. Not quite this time. And with that, we come to the end of the first period of extra time. Well, it may well be a case of who's got most to give now. Fitness levels look good, and it's not any less competitive. into the second period the tension pretty high even down there on the bench no room for complacency any mistake could prove fatal whoever scores now should go on to win the game well that's the theory anyway 
Cristiani. Cristiano Ronaldo. Well played, that got them out of trouble. It's Messi. Campagnaro. Messi. Augusto Fernandez. Here's Maxi Rodriguez. Ah, he's been thwarted. This match hurtling towards a penalty shootout. Or are we going to see a dramatic late goal? Ronaldo. What can Portugal make of this? Ronaldo. Chance. Glancing header. Portugal with a big chance and a big miss. Argentina needed in the box and quickly. Bruno Alves plays it to his right. He was well positioned, good defending there. Garay. There's the whistle, and so we're heading for the emotional roller coaster that is the penalty shootout. Well, it's all about nerve and bottle now for these penalty takers. They've just got to pick their spot and not change their mind. Time for the goalkeepers to relish their moment. A chance to step forward into the spotlight and to shine. A penalty shootout. Heroes and villains side by side. He bangs it past the keeper. Oh, the keeper's been completely wrong for today. Superb strike. He made it. It's 1 1. You could see he was really nervous taking that one, but he's made it one apiece. Gets nowhere near it. Well, he's filled the keeper with that one and sent him the wrong way. Great penalty. A natural leader showing plenty of composure. The skipper stands up and it's been saved. Oh, the keeper's done brilliantly to keep his eye on the ball and make such a great save. Putting this penalty away for a two-goal lead would give them a real psychological boost. Well, it's never easy to step up and take a penalty, but he slotted that home with authority. He really needs to put this away. If he misses, it's almost certain they'll crack. He was always looking good there. Nice penalty. And he put this one away for a two-goal cushion and calm those ragged nerves of his teammates, not to mention his manager, to the keeper's left. Oh, that was a great strike. He just gave the keeper absolutely no chance. Argentina now on the verge of defeat. If he doesn't score, they're out. With the team two goals down, he knows he has to score to keep them in the game. Yes, he's put it away and his team breathes a collective side relief. Well, it's never easy to step up and take a penalty, but he slotted that home with authority. Putting this penalty away for a two-goal lead would give them a real psychological boost. He scored! The game is over! Such a tight contest. There was nothing at all separating them. And the winner showed such excellent composure in the shootout. Well, there's really nothing quite like the excitement of a penalty shootout. And they'll be absolutely delighted to have entered their way. And that's the end of tonight's broadcast. From me, John Champion, and my co-commentator Jim Beglin, a very good evening to you.